Good morning everybody, we're back in London today. We're actually in West London, which I've never been to this area. We got off at Westbourne Park. I think it's Westbourne Park, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. And um, the houses are amazing. I don't know if I can just show you. I love all these balconies and this nice park in the middle and... Oh my I just God. want to live somewhere like I just, this. Yeah, you? I do. I really want to live somewhere like this. Um, but yeah, we came up because I've got a meeting in London today, which isn't till a bit later on. So we thought we'd come over to West London for a bit, um, go and find somewhere to eat some lunch, maybe do some work in like a cafe or something. Um, I think we're going to go for lunch in somewhere called Pharmacy because I've heard about it quite a lot. And I did ask people where we might be able to get like gluten-free and dairy-free pancakes. And actually someone said Pharmacy. So I thought I'd check it out and take you guys along with us and hopefully you'll see some some good food some nice buildings like around here but yeah it's gonna be a really good day I'm in Planet Organic and I just found these. They're some Foddy Food products, which is amazing. Low FODMAP in Planet Organic. I think I'm gonna buy one of these. So this is dark chocolate nuts and sea salt. Looks amazing. Definitely gonna buy this. So I found in Planet Organic the kombucha and kefir section. Now, I know this is good for digestion, but could someone please tell me why they're good and what they're good for and what they taste like? Because I haven't heard positive things about their taste. <laughs> Um, I like the look of the blue one. But like, yeah, look at this. I always like the look of that. So this is kefir, like, oh, um, and then we've got kombucha down here, and I just really don't know what it's all about. So, if you know, you let me I mean, know. It's easy to say buy it and try it, but yeah, but it's quite I, expensive. It's expensive, and I'm not really sure what it's all about. And I, yeah, so let me know. <laughs> So we made it to Pharmacy, which is in Notting Hill, Westbourne Grove, not really sure. Um, it's awesome looking. Look at that. Um, and we, well, we wanted to get some brunch stuff, but it's not brunch menu time. And they kindly made us brunch stuff anyway, which is amazing and very, it's very kind. So let's pan down. We're sharing these. We've got some gluten-free and dairy-free waffles, which look amazing. I'm, oh my God, so, so good. And then we've got gluten-free and dairy-free pancakes. Look at them. Oh my days. So we're gonna share these. They look great. This place looks amazing. The, the menu is ridiculous. There's nothing more food pornish than pancakes and waffles. How was that? That was amazing. <laughs> that was such a great time actually. The food was bellissimo. So how did you have brunch when they only do brunch of the weekend? Um, well... And it's what, Thursday? I, really, I was like, he came over to take our order and I was like, sorry, I think we're going to have to go. We'll come back at the weekend. Obviously, it was really awkward. Obviously that's a lie. I feel awkward doing it's that. a complete lie because we're not going to be here at the weekend. <laughs> I was just being polite. Um, and then the, a lady who was sitting at the side, who must be like the manager, doing some work on her laptop, she was like, oh, um, I think we can switch you out with pancakes. I was like, I was, hell yeah. So I was like, oh, don't worry. I, I, was, I was like, don't worry, we'll come back at the weekend, lie. But she, she went, like, no, don't worry. So she was like, that's fine. You want pancakes? What do you want? So I was like, let's have some waffles. A waffle as so well. we had gluten, we had gluten-free and dairy-free pancakes, gluten-free and dairy-free waffles. Um, we don't Not want to go down one. there. Never seen that lovely church before. <laughs> um, and it was amazing. Freaking awesome. It was really good, so. How do you go back? Uh, yeah, I'll be back next time. It's uh, it was a, uh, it was an awesome, awesome experience, and uh, the place is really nice. So I definitely yeah, recommend I it. it. Um, it's all vegetarian, and loads of it's vegan, uh, and loads of it's gluten free. So it's perfect. We are going towards Westbourne Park Tube Station, I guess. We're gonna go to Islington. We are going to Islington. Um, my meeting today is in Islington in a nice cafe. Um, that I don't know what the cafe is. Never been there before. But the person I'm having the meeting with suggested it um, it's pretty good and it, it does look really good so we'll show you uh, when we get there but the meeting's not until 
half three, four-ish. So we get there a little bit early. We might just go for a cheeky wander. Cheeky ream. Um, yeah, might want to go to cookies and scream. Might what, actually, what a surprise. Might actually do that. Yeah. So um, yeah, let's let's get walking a bit faster, please. Pick up the pace. <laughs> is where I'm having my meeting, or was having my meeting, until we came and it's being redone. Dear lovely customers, um, redecorating until the 28th, and today is the 24th, I think. So that's a shame. It looks very nice inside, though. Look at that on the wall. I like that. That's really cool. Um, but yeah, so, what do you think? Fight, we'll have to find an alternate meeting. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I know it's done fairly well, but not that well. Um, so maybe we should have a look for somewhere now, yeah. and then we can make a suggestion. What a great idea. Yeah. Bex is in her meeting, so now you're coming along with me, whether you like it or not. And we're going to Cookies and Scream, and we're going to see what we can get. So here we are at Cookies and Scream. I'm outside, I've only gone for a peppermint tea because I'm still so incredibly full from the pancakes earlier. Um, but I am gonna get a takeaway. I'm debating whether I should get a shake because they're dairy free and insane. Um, will it last the drive home? Because again, I can't really manage it right now. I think I might take that risk. I might buy some donuts. I might buy some cookies. And they've actually really got a nice out door area at Cookies and Scream in Islington, which is really, actually really kind of tranquil in the middle of London, while I enjoy my peppermint tea in this awesome mug. I don't know what it is. Lovely. I got stuff. Yeah, I got some scones. Nice. To practice. Do they usually do that? Yeah, I don't think they're dairy free, obviously. Hello. Do you want to do you look at my bag? Excuse me. Oh my. <laughs> I oh put my. that in there. It was too cold to carry it. Oh my. Let's go. <laughs> Lovely person. I also bought some stuff. And 
generally because I like buying stuff from Beyond Bread anyway. Um, so I'll show you guys what I bought when we get back and also obviously my went to the scream so we can show you what he bought. It'll be a surprise to me. Oh, so um, exciting. And we can see what he bought when we get back. So let the car driving continue and see you at home. So we made it home and now Mark is cooking some delicious dinner for us. Let's see. So what what are you doing, Sir Mark? Um uh, well <laughs> Uh, I'm cutting chicken in half. Okay. Putting lactose-free mascarpone in yeah, it. Yeah, because usually we put parma ham, but well, we don't... Yeah, I was going to say, it's it, not parma It's ham. not parma ham. But yeah, I'll show you some of the stuff that we got from our places. Okay, Beyond Bread. What is in here from Beyond Bread? Let's have a look. Now, firstly, I got myself a gluten-free baguette. Look at that. Just put that down there. Gluten-free baguette. Now that is something. That is something very good. So I got that. I also got myself a cookie. This is a peanut butter cookie. Gluten free peanut butter cookie from Beyond Bread. And then also these, which look delicious. I bought some scones. Um, yeah, they just look really nice. And I want to get into making some scones soon. So I thought, what better way? Then to test someone else's scones out and see what I like about the scones. So, there's those. So that's all I bought from Beyond Bread. Mark, as you know, got his um, his shake from Cookies and Scream, and he also brought this bag back. So what have we got in here? Oh my days. We have what is known as a Chico pie. Now Chico pie is like basically peanut butter cookie dough, peanut butter and chocolate chip cookie dough, all just made into a pie. There it is, Chico pie. Now that is the most delicious thing you will ever have. Is it quite a big one? Yeah, it's a big one. Warm that up for like 10 seconds, literally, in the microwave. Put it with a bit of ice cream. It's amazing. Oh, there's a bit that's come off. <laughs> mm. Did, you, did you steal that? Mm. Oh my God, there's some bits in the bag. Won't be eating those because it's dinner time soon, but there we go. What did you get here? Ooh, another cookie thing. Here we go. It is the ultimate. A cookies and screen cookie with jam in the middle. I think that's my favorite. Now, I'll come back over here. Boom. We've got some- Bada big bada boom. We've got some chicken wrapped in parma ham um, and stuffed with lactose free mascarpone ready for the oven. Oh yes. That's gonna go in, not. Not right now, not so, right now. so you're not even going to see it. But So I don't usually vlog at home, but I thought I'd end this one today in our lovely homely surroundings. If you'd like us to vlog a bit more in our little home, let me know. Obviously, when you're at home, it can be a bit boring sometimes, but you might like that. And you'd also get to see what we make on a usual day for lunch, for dinner, even for breakfast. I might even show you me in the morning, which isn't a great sight, but... Whatever, so let me know in the comments below if you'd like that because obviously we spend more days than not at home. We don't always go out to London and Brighton and all these nice places. Most of the time, we're just like normal people at home working hard. Um, so yeah, if you've enjoyed this video today, I really hope you have because I've had a great day. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you very soon for another video. Goodbye.